down immediately, and I'm grateful for that. Magnuson is still wearing a protective helmet uh, with a jaw guard for his fractured cheekbone suffered earlier in the year. And Oh, man, top there. That may be a first for J.P. Bordalo. That's the first time I've ever seen Bordalo jump anybody, Tim. You correct me if I'm wrong. Well, I, I'll say this for J.P. in this situation, though. He knows that Magnuson shouldn't be getting into it uh, because he's still playing hurt. He's got to protect that jaw. But did and you notice who else was in there of the Islanders? Face mask and all, broken cheekbone. Gary and now Pat Price. I'll tell you, anybody challenges Pat Price. Price is asking for trouble. Howitt and uh, Magnuson have a hole. That's Howitt with Magnuson. They both have uh, broken bones in their face. Tim, uh, right above the cheek uh, is a broken bone for Gary Howitt. He's got to let go. Magnuson still has his on, and Magnuson, of course, wearing the, the C for <laughs> At casting. least they're working together here now, yeah. Howitt and Magnuson. I guess that's even things up. You don't see the referee getting in the middle too often, but Wally Harris getting in the middle saying, hey, look, guys, uh, this is on delay tape to New York. We'll keep the people up all night if you guys go like this. <laughs> but, Tim, the observation, and I don't want to sound like a Chicago Hawks man, but please, Keith Magnuson has been named the team captain replacing uh, Stan Makita. The purpose of having Magnuson is that he is the fiery-spirited leader. Well, we've got a break in the extracurriculars and a break in the action in Chicago with 17.48 to go in the first period and no score. 